Well, Christine, Alex, the closure of this mobile home park is legal and it was approved by the city of Carson. But for the residents who were caught in the middle, they say it's completely unfair. People don't know where they're going to go. You're looking at senior citizens who are about to lose their homes of many years. It's dreadful. It's dreadful. For decades, these residents have called Imperial Avalon Mobile Estates in Carson their home. But now they're about to lose it. They're taking it from us. They're taking it, literally taking. Four mobile home parks in Carson with rent control are closing for new developments. Some 445 residents will be displaced. The news came as a shock to 90-year-old Morton Holtzman. He is furious with the city of Carson for allowing this to happen. They always said they'd take care of us, and they're not taking care of us. All they're out for is the rents can go up higher and higher. This is affordable housing, the only affordable housing that they have here in the city of Carson. Imperial Avalon LLC owns this mobile home park and is offering to pay the homeowners for their properties. But the residents say it's not enough money. So I have a two bedroom, two bath, 1,500 square feet. The home was built in the mid 1970s and I'm being offered 55420 so it's worth at least three times that, maybe four. A spokesperson for Imperial Avalon LLC issued a statement that says in part, considering that the park is closing, we are actually paying significantly more than the residents would find on the open market for their coaches. We understand that this is a challenging process and are going far above and beyond what is legally required. And we are glad to go the extra mile for our seniors as we help them find and relocate to their new homes. We will not have enough to replace what they're taking. And taking is the important word here. They are taking it. Another option the company is offering is relocating the mobile homes to new locations like Blythe, Hemet, Victorville, and Desert Hot Springs. It is insulting, especially when I work here in this area, in the South Bay area. Roughly six months is all these residents have left. Imperial Avalon Mobile Estates is scheduled to close in January. They don't care. For, they don't care for you. They, all they're out is anything they can get. Now, we reached out to the city of Carson, to the mayor and the city council members, but no one got back to us. I'm Gina Silva, Fox 11 News. Quite the story. We're going to stay on top of that.